What's up, y'all? This is Ron coming back at you with yet another car video. Many young men don't use Tinder. And when I say Tinder, that's basically covering all of them. But, yeah, Tinder's better for the algorithm. <laughs> hey, Ron's a capitalist. Hey, you know what, man? When I got up this morning, you know, for people who know, I always, like, the videos y'all see on, uh, you know, in the morning at 3 a.m., I had recorded them a week, maybe two weeks before. So I was recording a video this morning. I'm not going to tell y'all the title. Y'all see it when it comes up, but I'll just say it had to do with young men, right? Young men and uh, the type of women they get, a certain type of women that they would get, right? And... So I was, uh, and I had mentioned something briefly, just knowing, telling how I know how this is happening. And y'all see it. But I was thinking about that after, you know, I edited it and I uploaded it. Just just to be clear, I don't do any videos at 2 in the morning and then upload them. People think I do. No. At best, I'm waking up at 3 a.m. But everything's already been uploaded. But, you know, I was thinking about that. <laughs> Because, you know, you got sectors who think everything is based on, um, everything will be based on, um, you know, what's happening on Tinder or other sites. Like, people, like, it's cracks me up. Guys always say, well, these are the guys that women will go for on Tinder. Well, first of all, on Tinder anyway, men outnumber women nine to one. So, if you're going to win on Tinder, your shit got to be the bomb. And that's normal. But then at the same time, how many fine women going to be on there? And, you know, whatever. Somebody can argue whatever. But most young men, I'm going to say most. I say many at first. I'm going to put the word in most. I'm going to put it out there like that. They ain't doing stuff like that. They meet women in the streets and everything. Now, someone will say, well, how you know, Rob? Hey, shoot, you not out there. You not a young man. Somebody said in that video I recorded this morning. Most of my consultation clients are guys um, in their 20s and 30s. Young guys. Young guys. And I thought about that. I said, you know what? I got to think hard how many of them say they pick up women online. And I can think one I crossed my mind. and But that wasn't his main thing. That was a supplement to his game. He'd get a woman online every now and then because, well, he had about five women. And his main ones, he just met them just being out and about. Because the reality is this. Reality is this. Most, most people are meeting people in the real world. Like, you know, people, like I've always had some guys, and they'll say, oh, it's changed from them. Everything's online now. Yeah, for your Bama ass, it might be. And just to be clear, you ain't in the D.C. area calling someone a Bama. This is basically calling them a dork. And, yeah, your Bama ass might be, but most people ain't. Most people in the real world, and even a lot of people who use social uh, media or online and everything, they still get theirs in the world. They use it at best as a supplement, at best. And even then, it's not a lot of young people. Uh, believe it or not, the greatest cohort of... Uh, People online is going to be probably in their 30s and 40s and older because it's a little bit hard for them to be out and about and meeting people. And that makes sense, really. But this thought that, you know, the young men getting play are all online and stuff or, you know, they got all these women hitting their inbox is some bullshit. Even if they got, you know, they might have basic social media that's part of their game. But even then, they'll meet the women in the streets or something. Say, hey, put your number in. And I know this because, okay, consultation clients. I was thinking about it. I said, you know what? Because even the one who said he had got a couple women online, that wasn't the main conversation. Because first of all, nobody has ever hit me up and said, hey, how do I get more women online? Nobody's paid for a consultation session on that level. No one. No one. Because I would tell them straight up, too. You can give them their money. I said, that's not something I know. Because I don't be messing with it like that. And stuff, but nobody's hit me with it. They tell, in fact, most of the guys who hit me up, they hit me. It's more about how to manage the women they have. They only they got zero problems getting women. It's like, yeah, yeah, Rom, Rom, how do I manage these five women, or how I manage this older woman coming for me, or you know, bro, 
This girl drives me crazy. Yeah, she a dime and everything, but I don't know if I can take her anymore. I get rid of her. <laughs> it's actually rare some guys hit me up and it, they just totally bad. Seriously. Even some dudes overseas. Even some dudes overseas be hitting me up. They be like, well, yeah, I'm getting it or something. It's kind of easy when I do it. <laughs> but and they still not online either. Look, yes, there's some guys online and all of that, but most of them ain't. Most of them ain't because really guys who just really had trouble, that's not the majority. That's not the majority. Even when someone says 30% of guys not sleeping with... Uh, you know, not having sex or something. That means up to seventy percent is uh, basic math. Seventy is greater than thirty, and that that's just some real talk on that. That's just some real talk, and that's the thing to understand. And you know, not just consultation clients, but I got guys. I got some guys kind of in my inner circle. They can hit me up with texts. I got one brother. Shout out, uh, brother B. Shoot, every time some woman, uh, and that's an alpha showpiece. He's always like send me a text. They say, wow. Well, body game testimony, body game testimony, and stuff, and plus, I even know a lot of young ladies just in the area, like in their 20s and stuff, and they be letting me know how they, because I'm like Uncle Ron to them too, and they'll be like, well, you know, I got this profile online, they'll meet a guy or something, I'll be like, hey, where you meet him, it's like, oh, we work together, oh, you know, we met at this, uh, I don't know, some event. People ain't going to clubs because of uh, COVID, but a lot of people still be meeting there and stuff. In fact, most people, most young men, they're going to meet women just on their lives. If they still like in school or something, they meet them there. If they work in, uh, just work in some place, you got a, like a large uh, young people population. Like even with, despite that Me Too thing, you know, even young women got a fuck file and they be meeting on jobs. That's like normal. They be just meeting, you know. Funny thing is, uh, you know, get some guys and some guys be like, oh, you don't know what's going on. Everything's online now. Well, apparently I know what's going on more than they do. Because people forget, hey, when I'm driving around doing all that, I'm talking to people. You know? Yeah, a lot of, I know, it's virtually everywhere I can go places and meet someone or talk to someone. And plus, even on my IG, or even probably a lot of people hit me up just casually, let me know what's going on. A lot of young people, even uh, from Africa and stuff. Shout out to my man in Zimbabwe. He hit me up all the time. Shoot. Sure. On my private site, on my Patreon. And they it's usually about how to deal with who they dealing with. Shoot. Sure. It's not even about how to get women. And these are young guys. None of them be saying, oh, I, I met her on this dating site or something. But, you know, some guys don't realize that because they're not going outside. They, 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 their biggest issue is really just social issues. Because, I'm going to tell you what, these women out here thirsty. Like, just coming from the gym, if I'm just, just ordinarily, I'm walking out, somebody, like, women old and young, I've never seen before, don't know their name or something, I'm always like, hey, 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 hey. And I'll be peeping now, I'll be saying hi to anybody else. So, it's that easy. Seriously, there's nothing changed and everything. Now, I'll say social media is a good, uh, well, online dating is a good supplement. Or if you travel into a city, but just a supplement, you still got to be able to talk to them out here. And a lot of these young men are doing that. Because contrary to popular belief, like, I don't have to tell the young men about style. Shoot, they make sure their drip is okay. Or at least the ones who ain't some straight bammers. So, you know. That's the thing. And that's that's just the thing to get. Just to, like, peep the game, you know? Peep the game. And see, the thing I'm saying about that is some guys thinking they can't go out. Uh, look. Look. Anybody can fix up. Anybody can, If one can do it, you can do it. Seriously. You know, don't be like... First of all, like I said, if you're on some, some like, Tinder, where it's mostly men, on all the social medias, it's mostly men, with the exception of Bumble and stuff and even there if you gotta do that shoot at least fix yourself up but don't don't make that your main thing what if you see uh some fat booty woman or whatever you like physically and y'all just out and about you just out and about what you gonna do 
Hope she got social media. And that's another thing too. Let me shit. Let me let me hit up some stuff too. Don't get into texting battles or just texting. Some some guys like just want to text a woman. It's like, look, man, I'm gonna tell you something. I've had a lot of young women complain. They say, hey, you know, these guys don't want to talk. I mean, if you texting just some here and there, or where you gonna be, fine. But don't be having no long conversations and whatnot and stuff. Hold on. What's up, Rick? You out, man? All right, man. I'll see you in a second, fam. I'm all right, man. You, you know, I got to make my money here first. <laughs> I'll talk to you, man. But, uh, yeah. Oh, man. Shoot. My oh, man right there, man. Shoot. Straight play himself. And shit. So I know who doing what out this motherfucker. Seriously, a lot of dudes need to get their asses out the motherfucking house. Seriously, but seriously, most guys ain't even doing that. Or if they doing it, it's not their main thing. It's a supplement. So, anyway, that's about all I got for now. But seriously, I'm just telling you the truth. I'm just telling you the truth. You know, and I don't, I don't say anything based off of conjecture or anything. I know people. I know people. You know, and I'll tell you, shoot, put me under a lie detector test. Shoot, put put 10 FBI uh, profilers and stuff. Let them read my uh, actions and shit. I don't have time to play. So anyway, yo, that's all I got for now. Get back with you later. Peace and blessings.